just had a release um, as, a, as a featuring for uh, Paolo Einzing. Um, you like to um, work in collaboration as well as uh, featuring or uh, yourself as a team leader with your band? Um, yeah, honestly, for me, it's always a bit difficult to work together with other people because I really like to, to do what I want in my music. On the other hand, as I said before, it's, it's really a lot of work if you do everything on your own. So it's really nice to work together with people and I maybe I do the vocals or the texts and the other guys do the music or I do the music and the other guys do the text. Then it's like, yeah, if it's if it's good in the end, then for sure it's it's nice. But um, if I have all the time of my life, then I would work alone. Oh. Okay, <laughs> then w when you, <laughs> by example, with the last EP um, uh, just released, um, did you have a lot of contacts, real contacts, or was it uh, on internet with Skype or things like this? Uh, for you featuring, last featuring? To who? Uh, for Paolo Heinzing. Oh, no, I, I met him, I, I had a show in Basel, and then after the show, um, we, we met us in the backstage, and then we decided to go together to Zurich in the first train. And it was really nice, in this, in this uh, one hour train, we had a really nice conversation. And from the first moment we were like, okay, this guy is really nice, and yeah, we were like a good team, and then we decided, hey, let's make a track together maybe someday. And then suddenly he gave me, a, he sent me, a, sent me his track, and then hey Jan, what do you have time to mm -hmm. sing? Or, and I was like, well, um, I don't have time, but yeah, maybe, maybe if one week, yeah. And then yeah, so it was. Uh, when you when you work in collaboration, yeah. sometimes it's as a featuring, and sometimes it's, it's as a, a team leader with your crew. Um, it's interesting because you are on both sides, so you you know what uh, people can expect when you're working with them. Um, I think it's always like. And somebody gives something to you, then you give something back, and it's it's always in kind of an arrangement, maybe like like in music. It's I've I've never worked with somebody who told me like do it like this or do it like this. It was always like, hey, and do something. Or when I work together, for example, with my piano player, then for sure I have a certain idea how how I want the piano to be played. But it's always always a kind of a conversation, and I think it's really important because without conversation you can't. Okay, new music, I think. Mm -hmm. 